In this video we will be looking at how Moodle and Mahara integrate with single sign-ons. Setting up single sign-on between Moodle and Mahara takes a few steps and these are covered in excellent detail in a PDF that can be downloaded from the Mahara Wiki or from the Mahara Bytes course. This PDF document describes how to link your Mahara to a Moodle 1.9 or Moodle 2.0 site. The version of Moodle is indicated in the top right corner of every page, so make sure you are looking at the correct page while you are following the instructions. In the previous video, I covered how to set up single sign-on between Mahara and a Moodle 2.0 site. Mahara and Moodle can talk to each other once they are set up in the networking sections of both sites. Both have an SSL certificate key that allows the other to access the site. You can either set it up so that users from Moodle can click through to Mahara without having to log in again, or even create a Mahara account, or vice versa. I will demonstrate what this process looks like for students. I have set up my two sites following the instructions in the PDF file and they are configured so that when students from Moodle click through to Mahara, it checks whether they have an account against the Mahara database. If they don't have an account, it will automatically create one for them in an institution called Mahoodle. I am logged in to Moodle as a test student. On the front page, there is a link to my Mahara site. If I click on this, I will be taken to Mahara. This test student has never been to the Mahara site before, but their information is automatically transferred from Moodle. Their name, email, username, password, user picture, if they have one, and the introduction from their Moodle profile and various other profile fields. They now have a Mahara account that they can access any time they want by visiting Moodle and clicking on the link to take them here. They can create views, edit their profile, join groups. So from now on, when they click on that link in Moodle to go to the Mahara site, it will know that they already have an account and log them in automatically. Once they are done on Mahara, they can click Log Out and they will be taken back to the Moodle site. Or you can provide a link back to the Moodle site in the Site Links and Resources menu for logged in users. That way, they can get back to Moodle without having to log out.